Welcome back to PSC Tech Byte. First of all, let me remind you to subscribe to this YouTube channel by pressing the red button in the lower right corner of the screen. Today, I want to show you how we can extend the users and devices in Azure Active Directory using the extension properties provided and available through Microsoft Graph API. In fact, in Azure Active Directory, we used to have a set of attributes called on-premises extension attribute from 1 up to 15, used to synchronize extension attributes coming from on-premises and specifically from Exchange on-prem. Nowadays, very often, we simply rely on cloud-only users and as such, we don't necessarily need to write in those attributes information coming from on-premises. So, if you have cloud-only users or if you have devices stored in Azure Active Directory, you can easily rely on Microsoft Graph to read and write those extension attributes to store your own custom settings for users and devices. Keep into account that you can only store strings in those attributes and they are not selectable, neither searchable. So it is useful, but you need to keep into account the limits of this option. So let me move to the demo environment and let me show you how to use these extension attributes. This is the official documentation page about the on-premises extension attributes in Azure Active Directory. And here you can see all of the attributes as well as how they look like. So in order to use them, we can switch to Postman and play with it. First of all, if you want to target the extension attributes of a user, you can use the regular syntax of Microsoft Graph to target a specific user and to select some of the properties of the user, including the on-premises extension attributes uh, property. If you make such a query, you will get back the properties of the user, including the on-premises extension attributes. And here you can see you have all of the extension attributes for the user. Now, let's say that I want to customize these extension attributes. So I can make a patch request targeting the same user and providing uh, that I want to target in the body the on-premises extension attributes and setting the extension attribute number n, so from 1 to 15, with a specific value. In my scenario, it will be preferred color equal red. So let me run this request to the Microsoft Graph. I don't get any specific response except a 204. But if I will make another query for these users, I will be able to see that the extension attribute 1 is now preferred color equal red. So I can store whatever string I like inside any of the extension attributes. Of course, we can also clean up the extensions. So here I'm making another patch, still for the same target user, but now I'm providing null as the value for the extension attribute one. And it will simply remove the custom value and give me back a clean and free of custom values list of extension attributes for my user. So a really simple scenario, which allows us to add extensibility uh, settings for users and eventually for devices in Azure Active Directory using Microsoft Graph. Like always, thank you for watching this video. I hope you found it useful and I'm really looking forward to seeing you next week. Thank you.